Welcome to How to Get Bitches 101. I'm Professor Sholto, MD and PhD here at Sagma U. This is my second year teaching here. And please remember, I am a very credible professional and very non-fraudulent. I am I'm very qualified, okay? I am I am a very qualified person to be teaching this course. If I, I'm the only person here allowed to teach this course, they have no backup for me. If if I, I'm gone, then this class is gone. I go with it. The ship goes down with me. Okay. I think I have a laser pointer actually. Oh, there we go. Yes, I do. Ho ho ho! I have laser pointer. <laughs> can anybody can anybody define uh define risology for me? Anyone? Anyone at all? You there with the uh, the purple scarf? I don't think your dad is a proper uh, a proper definition for this this colloquial term. I think I'm going to have to reduct points for you for today. Bitches in risology refers to a non-specific gender person of interest you desire. It could, I could be bitches. Yeah, you are right. I could be bitches. Y you you could be bitches. Your your dad your dad could be bitches as well it can apply to any person so as long that they are the objects of desire from each individual right it's also synonymous with uh if you guys are familiar with this term as well i think some of you some of you know this pose or or Maidens, yes, maidens, indeed, hoes or maidens. Acceptance is the first step to helping yourself get bitches, right? Step one, recognize why you have no bitches, okay? And you have to accept that for yourself. You have to remind yourself that you yourself need to be worked on, okay? You are required to take the first step and and improve as as an individual okay ask yourself why what what are your flaws what can you change okay it can range from anything like maybe you just don't use enough deodorant right or maybe you don't touch enough grass maybe maybe you play league of legends unironically on a day-to-day -day basis it's something that stems differently from person to person as part of our melting pot of self-recognition okay Professor, you don't have any bitches. That's not true. That's not true. I'm very qualified. I'm a very qualified professional to be teaching this course. In order to teach this course, you don't necessarily have to have bitches yourself, okay? You don't have to teach the course. You don't have to have bitches to teach the course here, all right? You are coping, Professor. No, I can I can assure you I'm not coping here, student. And you you best keep your watch your tone. Watch your tone. I, I demand respect in my classroom, okay? So we can bribe for our credit. No, I mean I didn't I didn't say that, but if you want to bribe for your for your class credit, then uh, who am I who am I to stop you, right? But Okay. Again, you are bitchless, okay? You are the problem. Acceptance you bargaining bargaining is the third step right you may find yourself expending money at this point in order to believe that you do and have bitches when in fact no you do not have bitches all right example you may subscribe to shoto's only fans okay leading you to a good example of the bargaining step believing you have bitches when in fact again no you do not have bitches all right only fans i don't think i will be uh i will not be explaining myself any further from that example the example is stands as what it is okay you'll take a d for this class oh flip what wow wow good good example good example thank you for the uh, for the um mm. wow i don't know if i should praise that or not now look at popular games all right throughout the past years such as among us right among us among us among us gaslighting gaslighting among us who wins the games 
tell you, ask, answer me that question. Who wins these games? The person who can gaslight the best, correct? Theoretically, you can apply this here and use it as a self-applied method. Gaslighting yourself, correct? It's similar to a placebo effect, if you ever heard of that um, idea as well. Similar to manifestation, right? Manifestation. You guys remember that? Manifestation and and gaslighting, right? They go hand in hand. Gaslighting. It goes again. This falls, in my opinion under an umbrella term pretend that's an umbrella okay pretend that's that looks like an umbrella all right that's an umbrella right there this is to, to illustrate that um idea to you and again this is derived from the fact that you gain more confidence and drive all right why is everybody going to bed what's everybody going to bed for what is this disrespect wake up guys 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 I will not be tolerating uh, mid-class nap time. Well, you think this is kindergarten, huh? You think, this, you think this is fucking kindergarten? Okay, okay. You better wake up. 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 Come on. Come on. You may know me as Professor Schultel, MD, and PhD, teaching at Sigma U, correct? But I am also known typically as the Rizzard of Oz, the Rizlord, the Rizzler, the Rizzly Bear, right? Dwayne the Riz Johnson. I'm no, I go by many, many titles. This is part of my diploma, okay? Gra I graduated. Um, expertise in this field. Um, summa cum laude in my day. Some of you don't even know what the fuck that means, probably. What else do bitches like? What else do bitches like? People who are fearless, brave, and courageous, all right? For example. Brave, <laughs> courageous, what? What are you? Dude, dude, I confident, you. I, 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 fearless, <laughs> fearless. <laughs> people who aren't afraid of women. Yes, people who aren't afraid of women. Ah. Uh. Ah! Oh, shoot. These are pansies? Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Just gonna go in here, I, I guess. A toaster. See, see how much love oh, and uh, respect. I know exactly where to put this. He has for, uh, for women, yeah. right? Respect and love for women. <laughs> it gave me an achievement. Bro. Willing to go out of his way to More understand, bras. to understand. Okay. Not male wife enough. I'll show you male wife. As he has his, as you should, wife. exactly as you should. What? Again, what? this arguably. What is this? Huh? This arguably this ties really in, ties into, uh, <laughs> ties into being brave and fearless. As well. What else do bitches like? People who are good with kids, right? People who are great with kids. Again, example. Hey, baby, you wanna look at that? Observe. <laughs> Observe. Go in the hole. Go in the hole. <laughs> Go in the hole. No? What's in there? What's in there? <laughs> no? Nothing? Okay. <laughs> I remember uh, <laughs> seeing this ton once. <laughs> bonk, 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 bonk. <laughs> now, I would like to share with some of you guys uh, 
some Valentine's Day cards. Pissing all by yourself, handsome? Whore. Single? Can I borrow a kiss? I promise to give it right back. And my personal favorite, do you fart? 